Hello coin collectors out there. Welcome back to the International Coins and Paper channel. This coin that we're going to be sharing today is this one Pfeffing coin from Germany. Now this coin happens to be dated 1950, so that would place it right after uh, the Western sectors of Germany, which were controlled by France, United Kingdom, and United States, were officially merged. So those were officially merged on May 23rd, 1949 to form the Federal Republic of Germany. Um, the Soviet zone became the German Democratic Republic. So if we flip this coin over right here, we see the face value. And then on this side right here at the very bottom, that's where we see the 1950 date. So this particular coin was made from 1950 until 2001. So the year after they formed that country, the uh, Federal Republic of Germany, they started to produce coins like most countries do. And they produced this coin right here from 1950 until 2001. Now, many of you might know what happened in 2002. That's when the Euro coins start, started to come out. So this coin had a rather long run to it, being made all the way from 1950 until 2001. Its value is one Pfeffing, uh, which translates to 0 0.01 DEM. Its metal content is a copper clad steel. It has a weight of two grams, diameter 16.5 millimeters, and a thickness of 1.38. As you can see, its shape is round. Now on the obverse, which is the side you're looking at right here, it features a oak seedling, so a very small oak tree. When we flip it over, a uh, very simple design right here, we see the face value between two rye ears. So we see the rye ears on the left and the right, and then the face, face value dead in the center. Now this coin does have a mint mark also right at the top, uh, so we see this one happens to have the J mint mark on it. Now, uh, they were made at multiple mints. They were made at D, E, F, G, J uh, mints. So there are quite a lot of different mints out there. As far as the mintages go for 1950, the J mint mark, um, there were 784 million produced. There were also 772 million produced at the Denver, at, excuse me, the D mint mark, which isn't Denver, uh, F, there were 898 and G there were 515 million. So those are all just produced in the year of 1950. So add those all up well over a billion, well over 2 billion actually were produced for this coin right here. Now Germany is a very populated country, so it's totally understandable the need for so much currency. In fact, as far as they rank in terms of population, they're currently the 16th largest in the entire world as far as population, 62nd as far as area, and 5th as far as GDP. So they're producing a lot of goods and services out of Germany. Now, if you enjoyed this video, please do check out some of the other videos on this channel, including some of my other great German coins. So I have a more modern uh, two Pfeffing coin right here, dated 1971. This right here is a 10 Pfeffing coin, also dated 1971. So we see a little bit of a metal change from those two years. All right, everyone, that's all for this video. Thank you very much. Take care and best of luck coin collecting out there, everyone. Enjoy.